Aloha. Finn and Rachel's The Kiss That Missed already has 20,000 views on YouTube. And the comment section is just full of pithy banter. Like, why is that T-Rex eating the Jew? Ladies, I appreciate you spending time with me while Blaine recovers, but why are you being so weird and serious? Our periods don't come until the end of the month. A Latina Eve Harrington. Okay, if you're gonna be gay, you simply must know who that is. It's very civilized for you to invite me for coffee before you beat me up for spying. <sighs> Screw this, I'm getting a whole cheesecake. I got two cheesecakes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I actually thought we were all gonna get out of here, you know? But you can't take my new best friend. You don't own him, Rachel. I'm not speaking to you, traitor. Rachel, t selfish bitch. I'm no, Mercedes, you are wrong, okay? The bodyguard was originally written for Barbara Streisand. Actually, Rachel. I'm so depressed I've worn the same outfit twice this week. What? Okay, I think we've had enough of that. I said we lock Rachel up until after sectionals. I volunteer in my basement. Because I have made a selection that is perfect for being snowed in in New York City. Moulin Rouge, bitches. We love those dancing hoes. I did design and sew this costume myself. It's a little Project Runway, season six. Hello, welcome to Spotlight. I'm Kurt, I'll be your chorus boy waiter today. On your CD? The one that you are singing on? Oh, hail to the no. And what are you here to lecture us about, Kurt? Our horrible taste in clothing? My dad has cancer. I mean, I bring him a glass of warm milk every night just in hopes that we'll have a little lady chat. Warm milk? Really? It's delicious. Our thoughts are all with Kurt and, uh... My body? is like a rum chocolate souffle. If I don't warm it up right, it doesn't rise. Tell me more, tell me more. Cause he sounds like a drag. In fact, I was thinking for sexuals, we would do a medley from Greece. Who wants the sandy part? Is this even a discussion right now? Coach, I don't mean to interject, but um, I think we should end with a show circle. Cert? I'm cert, like the breathman. My balls keep falling off. I have been there. I'm what they call a bear cub. Because you look like Yogi. I think it's just, you know, a tad too. Unicorn? Uh, uh, gay. I feel like I might as well have a big neon sign up in my head that says, you know, gay, diddy, gay, 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 gay. My Power Rangers got married and divorced in so many combinations, they were like Fleetwood Mac. Stop it. Stop what? I am begging you. Sam is cute, but he's not worth losing Blaine over. Oh, how I've missed your insanity. I know what it's like to lose someone. When someone dies, it hurts. Very astute porcelain. That's a little nugget of wisdom I'd really like to jot down. Maybe Quinn is lactose intolerant. You smell like Craigslist. Rachel, what the hell is that? It's an engagement ring. Shut up! I'm sorry, did I miss the election for Queen? Because I didn't vote for you. I believe I found a song that finally expresses my true voice. Never even knew. How did you become so smart and adorable? Hmm. I'll take it from here. Nice effort. But only I can lead this barb invention. Is she here? No, this is a mall in Ohio. Are you on anything? Because this is trippy. You smell homeless, Brett. Homeless. Amazing. 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 Gay. 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 Oh my gosh! I opened my mouth and a little purse falls out. Okay. I'm get in there. Mercedes. Oh my god! It's an honor to meet you, Miss July. And oh, you got some abs. Ooh, baby cupcakes. Hey, I'll bring them to work with me. Weekends, I volunteer at a stray cat rescue. It's at the bottom of a coal mine. No, that was a joke. I, I don't. I don't work at a coal mine. I could totally sing the song with Finn, but screw him if he thinks he's taking the Diana Ross part from me. Oh my god, it's the Gerber baby. I heard your performance in Tana. This is mine and you know it. If he and I got married, the gap would give me a 50% discount. I'm thinking of a uh, russet and cognac theme. Huh, those are colors, Finn. Fall wedding colors. Like He's on Team Gay. No straight boy dyes his hair to look like Linda Evangelista circa 1993. Ever since you separated from your wife, you've spent a lot of late nights watching reruns of Law & Order, haven't you? No one here knows I'm gay. Can I be honest? Just with the hair? I think they do. I think that you are the biggest unicorn. I'm sorry? So one of you two is girlfriend? But I'm not ready to be exclusive just yet. Can you excuse us for a minute, Bo? What? Just go away. I'm with you. One day, you all work for me. I'm gonna lose unless I pull a JFK. 
You're gonna shoot Brittany? No. Dude, you're gay. Excuse me? Are you looking for teaching at a place where pencils aren't primarily used as weapons? At least you don't have to worry about me getting someone pregnant. <laughs> what are you doing? Trying to keep the flames from shooting out of the side of my face. I have a proposition to make. A makeover. I'm in. Makeovers are like crack to me. I'm gonna take this down to the park and watch drug deals go down. Stay out of this, fan. This is between Santana and me. Well, it's between me, too. I'm as much a part of this group as anybody else. And I'm tired, happy I'm tired of all the problems you're making up. Order. May I please say something? We all know I'm more popular than Rachel. And I dress better than her. I, I don't just want to be known as, you know, Kurt Hummel homo. Brittany and I were just uh, having sexual relations. Okay, put your helmet on. I don't mess up my hair. Put your, put your helmet on, okay. I'm pretty sure she just stole my comforter. Yeah, bitch took my pillow. I mean, it's obvious that Rachel's only letting him stay in the club because she has a fat crush on him. So do you. No, I don't. Oh, get real. You do too. I'll teach you the proper ploys when you talk to boys. I just, I really want to be your friend again. Well, maybe you should have thought of that before you walked all over me and your borderline sociopathic climb to the top. Hi, I'm Kurt Helmel and I'll be auditioning for the role of kicker. Shouldn't you be in college or something? I thought gay people were all successful overachievers. I am oh, a successful. Oh, don't pay it. Have you ever kissed anybody? Yes. If by someone you mean the tender crook of my elbow. Okay, Tina, I say this with total love, but the moment we all saw coming is finally here. You're a hag. You're hagged out, you're in love with Blaine, and it's creepy. Stop. <laughs> I don't like you. Fun. I don't like you either. I don't like the way you talk to my boyfriend. I don't like your smirky little meerkat face. I don't like your obnoxious CW hair. I'm on to you. Juilliard doesn't have a musical theater department. Wait, what? Thank you. Oh my god. Cut the butter, Benedict Arnold. I think we can help. Mercedes is black. I'm gay. We make culture. All right, have you guys chosen a, no, a wedding song? Uh, this song is terrible. Okay, no, no, it's not the song. You guys just need to get into it. No, it's the song. It's really gay. Devil in a red dress. Perfect, and it's totally appropriate for your personality. <laughs> I have no criticisms. Go with God, Satan. Santana. Because we're gonna give them what they want. Blood. If you ain't, I'll tell ya one more time. I never want to mess my thing up with him in any way. He's really great. Who's really great? You. Where do you think you'll be in the year 2030? Broadway. Twinsies. We have found ourselves a kicker. Sure, we'll just call ourselves the Areolas. Nope, Areola 51, get the sci-fi geeks. I was being sarcastic. Greet each other. Most of the time I find it hard to be in the same room with you. Especially this one. Which looks like where Strawberry Shortcake and Holly Hobby come to hook up. Don't tell me you agree with me when I saw you kicking dirt in my eye. And then I said to Justin Timberlake, that's not eggnog. Oh, wait, wait, uh, you didn't do this for me, did you? Because if, if you did this for me, I mean, it'd be very romantic for one, but I mean, like, it could lead to resentment, which could lead to anger, which could lead to a horrible, horrible, nasty breakup, like, you know, on The hey, Bachelor, hey, when you hey, watch hey. that. They're gonna throw fruit at us. And I just had a facial. And she changes her look faster than Brit changes sexual partners. Let's go to, and Friday nights are the best. By the way, you look cute today. And I mean, like, like, dirty cute. I'm the luckiest guy in the world. Yeah, pretty much. And Blaine and I are like an old married couple. A fabulous old married couple, like Paul Newman and John Woodward, but I don't think we've had an unscheduled makeup session in like a month. You schedule makeup sessions? <laughs> Fate brought them together. Dad, meet Carol Hudson. Miss Hudson, my father, Bert Hummel. You both have dead spouses. Maybe you should talk. Uh, are you crying? Um, no, no, my, my, my contacts are really bothering me right now. I didn't know you were contacts. Yes, Rachel, I just found out I have a slight astigmatism. Uh, hey. Hey, where'd you get that dinosaur suit? Found it in a dumpster in the Bronx, so I put it on. 
But then I was afraid it might have lice, so I took it off. But then I missed having it on, so I put it back on. So get on point, Kitty. Your little theory about Mercedes shattered dreams, like most of the garbage that comes out of your mouth, is wrong. What the hell does Beyonce have to do with football? Why don't you ask Kurt? He seems to be the only one who can score on this team, even in practice. So we're taking- Damn, Kurt, this car is fly. My dad got it for my sweet 16 after I swore to stop wearing form-fitting sweaters that stop at the knee. What he doesn't know doesn't hurt him. Just not quite as popular as me. You make this, and you die a legend. Can I pee first? Don't cry for me, Argentina. I knew this would be a little weird for you. It's a living nightmare. What? No, it's, it's not weird at all. No, uh, so, uh, how'd you two meet up again? Mm. Oh. oh, guys, mm. I would kill the breakout in song right now. Me! <laughs> Sit down, girl. I think I love ya. Bernardo or Officer Krupke, as long as it was opposite your Tony. Oh. Kurt, jazz hands. Fine. Look, pretty girl. You'll never catch me alive. You're quiet. No, I'm being passive aggressive. So is that a men's sweater? Fashion has no gender. Oh, Bambi. I cried so hard when those hunters shot your mommy. Hey, what you doing? Nothing. Just uh, daydreaming. I've never, I've never been so humiliated in my life. Either. That's a really high bar. Are you not drinking? No. Designated driver. What about you? I'm still trying to impress play. Can't get too sloppy. Clearly he doesn't have the same concern. Who put him in bed when he got sick and rubbed vapor up on his little muscle chest while he slept? What? You, huh? What? No, I didn't mean. This isn't about me, Kurt. I have to go. Did you vaporate my ex-boyfriend? Don't walk away from me, Tina Kochang. What would you have done? Just run like they tell us? I played football, Kurt. So did I. As a kicker! Tell me now that we're not back together. I mean, it was fun. Don't, but I'm- Like the way he's speaking, his confidence is peaking. Don't like his baggy jeans, but I'ma like what's underneath him. That's fantastic. Mm, so is my primo collection of vintage muscle magazines. Want them? Mr. Schuster. I changed my mind. April should stay. I worship her. Hey, Blaine. Hello, everyone else. Does he live here or something? Seriously, you were always here. It's because I'm his big bear and he's my little cub. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna be sick. I'm gonna throw up. And when did Blaine start liking bears? Hashtag D-I-L-L-I-G-A-S. Hashtag, hashtag. Hashtag, hashtag. Hashtag, hashtag. Hashtag, 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 hashtag. When I called you a hag, I was bringing attention to the fact that you were honoring the noble and proud tradition of hagdom. Uh, yeah, and I for one am psyched that my very first hag was someone as kick-ass as Miss Tina, Tina Cohen Chang. Your boyfriend's bare ass is on one of my vintage flea market chairs. It is time you and I had the talk. No, it's not. Yes, it is. You told me to educate myself. Hey, you think this is easy for me? Okay, believe me. Girls, they're your problem. They're up, they're down. Girls. Okay, my turn. Are you okay? You kept making those weird faces the whole song. Those weren't weird faces, those were my sexy faces. It just looked like you were having gas pains or something. Great. How are we supposed to get up on the stage at regionals and sell sexy to the judges when I have as much sexual appeal and knowledge as a baby penguin? Intern and I spent all of my money on my last trip home, so. Well, I could give you my JetBlue frequent flyer mouse. I can't use them for since I was banned from my... How about, you know, something like, um... Something like that. That's you... all I like to spit. I like to spit. Okay, now give me... Sultry. Um, Kurt, they're, they're all sort of looking the same. Music pumping hard like I wish it would. Now push it. Push it. 
I needed to ask you something. Thanks, but I already have a date to the prom. But I'm flattered. I know how important dances are to teen gays. I'm not gay. Oh. It's hammer time. Please, this is Mark Jacobs' new collection. Wait. Okay. Mash up ideas in my emergency mash. Kurt, I'm gonna say it again. Boys team. I say we before you break my I know your plans don't include clubbers accept the fact that people hate you and think you're nothing but a glorified karaoke club designed to make the invent I want you so bad. I don't know how to be sexy because I don't know the first thing about sex. Kurt, you're blushing. I've tried watching those movies, but I just get horribly depressed and I think about how they were all kids once and they all have mothers. And God, what would their mothers think? And why would you get that tattoo there? Someone get me to a day spa stat. Did he ever actually say you two were dating? Well, not in so many words. Well, did he put the moves on? No, but we were always singing duets and he was always smiling at me. Oh my God, I made up the whole thing in my head, didn't I? Eat your heart out, Kate Middleton. You do realize how trashy Lassimus this is, right? Pavarotti? Say what you have to say to my face. Welcome back, lady. <laughs> I don't suppose there's any way you could just cut out the last part. So, listen, Kurt, this is like the third time we've gone out. Can we just make it official? Make what official? You know that we're dating. I'm sorry, Mercedes, but I thought I made it very clear. I'm in love with someone else. Rachel? Yes. For several years now. I'm glad you asked. This year we'll both be applying to a New York-based performing arts school. And Juilliard. We'll get an eclectic little apartment on the Lower East Side. Pink Vet and Barbara Hershey beaches. Mm. Pre-cardiomyopathy. I'll originate a role in a new Sondheim musical, Tony by 25. Married by 30. Legally. Broadway, Lincoln Center, West End, a tasteful HBO miniseries. It's all right here in my planner, you see. Quitters. I'll see you downstairs. <laughs> you realize we just did the gay high five? Yeah, we did. Wait, no, please! I'm a terrible swimmer! I'm allergic to water! Get in there, dweeb! Stop! It's a waste of water. What if we name our band the Nip Slips? Boob lovers of all. Oh. Mm. Oh. Had I known I was gonna get groped in the back of a priest, I would have changed clothes. <laughs> I'm gonna go in there looking like prom the morning after. Mm. Mm. Wait, what am I doing? I'm sort of dating somebody in New York. Uh, you're not in New York, and it's not exclusive, right? You and this fey boy tie, just, it's my crib tonight. Oh. Oh. Wait, this doesn't mean that we're back together, right? I know, no, no, it's cool. That's cool. I know, I know. It's, it's, it's This is just bros helping bros. Oh, I love when you talk fratty. Mm. Mm. Tell me that's not Tina again. Someone's always trying to stop my baby crying.